Bahamas. The Princess K. Yay! Here, I'll give you a look around. Alright, so we have stopped at Princess K's. Um, we're not due to get off the show for another hour. So we're just, we had breakfast and now we are just kind of hanging out. Getting the shore bag ready and enjoying the beautiful weather. There we go. We're close to the bridge. We like to be in the front of the ship. We are hanging out in the piazza until it's time to get the tender to Princess Kay's. Always love the wonderful views of the ship from the tender boats. On the island, now off to find great seats to enjoy this beach day. Ready for our excursion? There's Mike. We're gonna go swim with the stingrays. Should be fun. Oh, slow will be. Of course. Exciting. <laughs> All right, here we go. Bye. Stingray excursion at Princess K's. This is an easy excursion. You walk in from the beach, the water is shallow, and the stingray experts were informative and super friendly. And the stingrays were all around us.
Y vuelta a ella. Go for oh, take picture. I'm handing your snorkel back to you. Oh.
if we can do it one more time over here. Do you want, can you do it for the camera? Can you do it one more time? Right here. I got it on. Oh my God. Thank you. That's dinner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Is that one empty? Oh no, he's there. Yeah, he's, he's hiding in there. Oh, oh yeah, I can see him. <laughs> Oh, that is so great. I've never seen one. Whoa! He's outside down. Thank you. Thank you. I had to come back to you. After a great day on the island, we have headed back to the ship. enjoyed a nice beverage as we got ready for sail away. After freshening up, we headed to Crooners for some pre-dinner drinks and people watching. Jody and we cruise director. Uh, my co-host tonight is the beautiful Izzy, who's going to be helping us out. And uh, we are going to be trying to get you out in three minutes or less with our Yes No Game show. Now, folks, rules are nice and easy. First of all, all you need to do is survive three minutes without saying the words yes or no. However, there are a few extra little T's and C's that apply. Yes, so one of them, as you can see here behind us, we have a whole board of all the different languages. <laughs> all right, Mike, do you understand the rules? I do. Fabulous. Are you ready to get started? Very much so. Audience, help me count them down in three, two, one. Here we go. Mike from Toronto, or should I say Toronto? Toronto. T Toronto. Toronto. So I'm just taking out the T. That's how we say it. Okay, that, that's very much a North American thing. 
Do you say water? Can I say water? Of course. No, but I say water. Water. You say water. Water is. There we go. Now, uh, how long have you been living in Toronto for? Since 1991. 1991. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Be careful with those. <laughs> where, where did you live before? I'm originally from Montreal. Montreal. Parlez-vous français? Je sais un petit peu. Yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is French the main language in Montreal? Not necessarily. Oh, do they speak English there as well, I'm assuming? They speak multiple languages. What other languages do they speak? English, Hungarian. Hungarian? <laughs> German. Hungarian in Montreal? Arabic, Arabic. These are like, are they like actual, like, national languages? It's multicultural. Oh, so in South Africa, we have 11 official languages. Are those all official languages of Montreal, of Canada? In Canada, there are two official languages, English and French. Ah, okay. And uh, tell me, what do you do? What do you, what do, you do now other than cruising? Do you work? Than, other than cruising, uh, annoy my wife. <laughs> and I manage an um, emergency response center. Emergency response center. That sounds exciting. It's a lot of fun. It's busy. It keeps me uh, on my toes. Speaking of emergency response center, there goes one of our paramedics. <laughs> we need help. He's doing well. All right, now, uh, is that your wife videoing you? That is definitely her. <laughs> she looks lovely. How long have you been married? 32 years. 32 years? Yes. <laughs> You've just, just made it. All right, you get yourself that notebook as well. After the yes, no game, we headed to the theater to see the comedian. My brother collected comic books. My father collected empty bottles. Well, it's better than to call him an alcoholic. But uh, I happen to collect jokes. So I'm going to put a little challenge out to you folks that I did in the first show. If you see me around the ship, come up. And then it was ready for bed. Join us tomorrow for New Year's Eve.